Welcome to the Exact Contact tutorial series. In this tutorial, we are going to show you how to take advantage of the robust email campaign reporting found in Exact Contact. For every mass email campaign that you send, Exact Contact automatically collects detailed deliverability and open stats on your campaign. By understanding and taking advantage of these statistics, you can refine your campaigns in order to get the most out of your email marketing. To access your email campaign reporting in Exact Contact, Simply click the mass email option in the main menu and then click the campaign reporting tab. Note that no statistics will appear until you send your first mass email. The initial page that displays when you click the campaign reporting tab is the mass email deliverability summary. This provides a dashboard overview of the overall deliverability statistics across all of your email campaigns. Each of these statistics is important, so I'm going to explain what each one means. Total messages sent is simply the total number of mass email campaigns that you have sent in the selected month or months. Total email sent is the total number of individual email addresses that you sent to across all of your campaigns. Total bounce backs is the total number of emails that could not be delivered to the recipient for some reason. We will discuss bounce backs in further detail later on. Total message opens is the total number of times your emails were opened. Unique message opens is the number of times your emails were opened by unique recipients and subtracts from the total message opens uh, recipients who opened the same email more than once. The next two statistics measure the number of times recipients clicked on hyperlinks in your emails. If you create mass emails that include one or more hyperlinks to, say, your website or a listing web page, Exact Contact automatically tracks how many times recipients clicked on these links. Like the message open statistics, the total click-throughs measures the total number of times recipients clicked on your links, while the total unique click-throughs accounts for individual recipients who clicked on the same link multiple times. The average open rate is the average percentage of contacts who opened your emails. The average click-through rate is the average percentage of contacts who clicked on at least one link in your emails. The global, average, global campaign averages graph to the right provides a quick breakdown of the average open rate versus your bounce back rate versus the unopened rate. The list at the bottom of the page is a list of all the mass email campaigns that you have sent. The list includes important high level statistics for each campaign, including the date sent, the total number of email recipients, the total number of bounce backs, the total, the total valid sent emails, and the campaign specific email open rate and click through rate. You can click on any column header if you wish to sort the list by that column. Note that the summary page displays by default statistics for email campaigns sent in the current calendar month. If you want to view the statistics for a different month or for a range of months, simply use the month and year selectors at the top of the statistics summary and click the view results button. In addition to the overall statistics that are available on the summary page, you also get detailed statistics for each of your individual email campaigns. To do this, click the subject line of the email in the list. A new page opens up with the statistics for the selected campaign. The individual campaign statistics are separated into three tabs. The general staff provides many of the same statistics as the summary area for the selected campaign, there are also three additional graphs at the bottom of the page that provide valuable information about when your emails were opened. This includes the email opens by date, by time of day, and by weekday. This information can be useful in determining the best day and time to send your future mass emails. Scrolling back up to the top of the page, you will see that in the general statistics area, there are details links next to the recipient list and unique open details headings. If you click one of these links, the bottom of the page updates to display the list of names and email addresses of either all of your recipients or the recipients who opened your email. For the recipients who opened your email, there is an additional hit number column that displays the number of times that each recipient opened the email. The list displays 20 recipients at a time. 
Click the page numbers in the bottom right corner of the list to display subsequent pages. The second tab in the individual email campaign statistics page is the bounce step back stats. Click this tab to view detailed statistics on recipients who did not receive your emails. The chart at the top of the page displays the total number of bounce backs and the percentage of the total recipients that this represents. The remaining information on the page, both in the graph to the right and in the list below, provides a breakdown of the reasons why your email could not be delivered. The glossary at the bottom of the page explains what these reasons mean. I will explain some of the more common reasons. A hard bounce means that the email address was invalid at the time the email was sent. In order to help your future deliverability, the system will automatically stop sending to email addresses that are hard bounced multiple times. A soft bounce indicates that the email address is valid, but messages to the address were temporarily undeliverable at the time you sent your mass email. An example of this is if the recipient's email mailbox is full. A spam notification means that the email address is valid, but your message was blocked by an email server spam filter. If you send emails that include a lot of salesy content, you should expect to see some of these bounce types. If you were seeing a lot of them, you may want to consider eliminating some of the salesy wording in the subject line or body of your emails. To get a list of email addresses for any of the bounce types, simply click the details link in the list. Click the back back button to return to the summary list. The third tab in the, on the page displays the link analysis for your campaign. For each hyperlink in your email that gets clicked at least one time, the list displays the total number of clicks, the total unique clicks, and the percentage of total recipients who clicked on the link. Note that if at least one recipient unsubscribes to your future emails by clicking the unsubscribe link that is automatically added at the bottom of every mass email, that this hyperlink will also appear in the list. To see a list of the names and email addresses of the recipients that clicked on each link, click the details link in the list and click the back button to return to the summary list. At any time, you can click the message list link in the top right corner to return to the overall deliverability summary page. You now know how to take advantage of the robust mass email campaign reporting features found in exact contact.